Hi, my name is Alex and welcome back to another video in our arts and crafts series. Today we'll be making a paper mache volcano. For this craft you're going to need flour, water, a bowl, a whisk, a box or piece of cardboard, an empty water bottle, masking tape, scissors, a newspaper, paintbrush, Mod Podge, and paint. First, you're gonna take your bowl and your whisk and your flour and water, and you're gonna start by adding two cups of water to your bowl. Then you're slowly gonna add in your flour, mixing as you go, and you want it to be a pancake batter-like consistency. Once your paste is made, you're going to set it aside and then you're going to take your newspaper and scissors and you're going to cut about two inch wide strips. Once your strips are cut, you're going to place them to the side and then you're going to take your empty water bottle and your scissors again and you're going to cut just this top section of the water bottle off. Next, you're going to take your bottle and your tape and you're going to put some tape on the bottom and you're going to stick it to the middle of your cardboard. Once you have placed your bottle in the middle, you're going to take your tape again and you're going to start forming your volcano by putting a strip of tape from the top all the way down to the base. Once your tape is in place, you're going to begin by taking pieces of newspaper and crumpling them up, and then you're going to add them underneath the tape and begin forming a volcano shape. Once all of your crumpled newspaper is in place, you are going to begin forming the outside of your volcano by dipping the newspaper strips that you cut into the paper mache paste, making sure to only have a light coating of the paste, and then you're going to place it onto the volcano. Once your volcano is completely covered, you're going to set it aside to dry. This should take about 12 to 24 hours. Once your volcano has dried, it's time to paint it. Now you're going to take your Mod Podge and you're going to cover the entire volcano. Once your volcano is dry, we're going to make it erupt. To do this, we're going to use vinegar and baking soda. You're going to take your baking soda and add it to the volcano. Once your baking soda is added, we're going to add the vinegar.
Thank you for joining us for our paper mache volcano. For more fun videos, please check out our social media and our virtual community center at cityoflosalamitos.org slash recreation.